Hey guys, so if you watch my latest video, you know that I am pregnant and I thought I would share with you how I told my family. So let's get to it. Welcome back to Lima Bean Living. If you guys are new here, my name is Emily. Welcome to my little motherhood channel where I take care of all things mom. In today's video, I am sharing with you guys how I planned and how I executed telling my family how um, I'm pregnant. So I had been kind of dwelling on this idea for a while and I thought like it would be the, just the perfect way to tell my family. So my family really enjoys playing charades and often we text each other like the word or phrase that we're like directing towards one of our siblings or our parents or something like that. And so once I found out that I was pregnant, I ended up telling my parents and my family, I think about two weeks later. And during this two weeks, it was really hard for me to keep it a secret just because for our first pregnancy, I wasn't even around anyone. I had to tell them kind of via a video because we were living up in Washington and you know this time around it was like I'm with my family all the time and it's it's hard for me to keep that big of a secret from them and I had already been keeping a secret from my parents because we were planning their 40th surprise party so it was just really tough for me to hold this in I also appreciate any and all prayers because I am a little nervous of being pregnant, not necessarily being pregnant, but I guess giving birth because that wasn't a very pleasant experience for me last time. So just, you know, all this going on, I really wanted to tell my family. And so I knew for two weeks before I told my family and it was actually going to be a little bit longer, but I'll get to that a little bit more later. So once I knew, I knew that I wanted to kind of incorporate charades into me letting my family know that Juan and I are pregnant. And I figured I would be the one to text my mom that I was pregnant and let her do the charading. So for the two weeks that I was keeping it a secret, I was like, mom, I've got like the best phrase for you to do charades. I'm, it's going to be so good. It's so good. I'm going to record it. Like, and she was just, she was starting to sweat a little bit. She's like, oh gosh, you know, like the pressure, you know, what if it's a word no one knows? And so she was just kind of thinking like, I found this ridiculously hard word to act out. And little does she know, you know, it was just Emily is pregnant. It shouldn't be that difficult. But I just, I wanted to not break out a camera randomly uh, and have her like be like, why are you videotaping me? You know, so I, I had to build up. And the other reason I was also waiting for so long was I wanted my whole family to be there. And my brother and his wife live in Arizona, but they came in special for my parents' 40th anniversary party. So we finally got everyone all together. And the following week was going to be our family vacation. So I was originally planning on doing this while we were doing charades at our family vacation, but I couldn't hold it in any longer. And it was a special day already for my parents. And I just figured why not? So our family was there after the party and we were just kind of relaxing. And I was like, let's play charades, you know? And um, a couple people went before me. And then I captured this footage that you guys will get to enjoy right now. Okay, okay. now I can look at your phone. <laughs> Are you serious? Yes. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, Emily. Oh, I can't say the other word because it'll give it away. Mom. Which words are the Three words. Oh, yeah. Let your mom do it. Okay, fine. Okay. Crying. This is this is not part of the I love you. Um so yes. you guys three, three words and just act out context. Okay, context. Um Pregnant? Baby. 
like I said, uh, you know, this happened the day of my parents' surprise 40th anniversary party. So my mom was really emotional already. Just she had an emotional day. And then she gets this news and she starts crying. And I was like, how did that not like give it away already? Um, but, you know, people just kind of figured she was just emotional because of the day. So it probably worked out even better uh, in that sense. But uh, everyone was really happy and you know I think my nephews really want it to be a little boy because they just there's only two of them and there's a bunch of girls now so uh, either way I'll be happy just as long as it's a healthy baby and uh, a better experience for me but yeah that's how I told my family let me know how you told your family or maybe you want to tell your family down below in the comments and just for some added fun I will include the footage of how I told my parents that I was pregnant with Aubrey in 2018 uh, when we were just separated by a couple of states and I couldn't really tell them in person so here you go I hope you enjoy don't forget to like this video and subscribe if you guys are new to follow along on my very exciting journey ahead, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. to the end of the video. If you didn't know already, every Monday and Friday you can find motherhood and lifestyle content on this channel. And since us moms have to do it all, that may mean yummy recipes, easy DIYs, mom hacks, cleaning and organization, or just a combo of everything. Please know that you are loved and you are made for greatness, and I will catch you in the next one.